Hey everybody, welcome back to the Turf Sub Canada YouTube channel. Alex here, founder of Turf Sub Canada, as usual. Um, anyways, I wanted to go over two measurements that are super important for you guys to note when getting quotes on artificial grass or just simply looking at the product, you know, wherever you might find it. Um, these are gonna be pile height and face weight. You guys are gonna find out what they mean and what to look for, what a lower height is, what a heavy weight is, everything you need to know. Uh, before I get into pile height and face weight, I want you guys to go and check out our other videos if you haven't seen them yet, going over color tones and fiber shape. These are also super important things, and at the end of the day, we want you guys to be the most informed customer for artificial grass on the market. Um, anyways, let's dive in. Okay, so with the samples I have in front of me, I have variants in pile height and face weight. Now, what do these mean? Pile height is simply the length of your grass. So if you'll notice, when I turn these sideways, you have something that's a little bit longer, something that's a little bit shorter. This is your pile height. Now, a common pile height in the industry is going to be somewhere between 1.5 and 1.75 inches. This would be an average to long length turf. Uh, you're going to find stuff as short as 1.25 inches and maybe as long as 2 inches. 1.25, uh, again, that's anything lower than that. You're probably dealing with like a specific pet turf. Uh, something with super, super high durability because of its low fibers. However, the aesthetic is not going to be long and lush like the products that you would need in a backyard. Uh, the second thing we're going to cover today is face weight. Now, when considering face weight, you're going to look for something that is between 35 ounces and then, you know, as high as 95 plus ounces. Now, what does that mean to you as a customer? The lighter the face weight is, the lighter the product is per square yard, it means lower density, lower length in often cases. Now you may have a case like this, where something with a high pile height, higher than this, actually has a lower face weight. This is because the density of the product is much, much thinner. So when you're looking at these measurements, consider what they tell you about the product. Now oftentimes people just throw out these numbers, they think higher face weight or higher pile height might be better for what you need. That is not always the case. Uh, there's many factors to consider as you guys know as a customer when picking an artificial grass and again we just want you guys to know what these measurements mean in terms of density, in terms of length and uh, you know how it affects your lawn. Um, consider our other video about fiber shape because it really complements what you guys are looking for here. Something with a lighter face weight but has a good really strong fiber shape might still be able to handle traffic um, whereas something with you know a flat fiber might have a really long pile height and you're gonna get something that mats very quickly in a high traffic situation um, so again if you guys have any other questions that you want me to go over on this topic specifically drop them in the comments below uh, also leave comments about new videos that you want us to make to help you guys be the most informed customers on the market and uh, you know we always love hearing from you guys as always please come by the showroom in Mississauga, make an appointment. You'll find the form to make an appointment on our website, www.turfsupcanada.com. Uh, the grass is always here, and I always love seeing new customers come by. Uh, we always love educating you guys. So any questions you have, drop by or drop us a note in the comments, and we'll answer. Uh, subscribe to the channel to learn more and stay up to date on all the videos that we're making uh, to help you guys pick the right grass for your lawn. Uh, turfs up.